Okay, sixth grade, lesson 34, and this is on decimal place value. Alright? So we've learned um, the left of the decimal. For example, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands. What goes next? Oh, uh, two hundred thousand? No. <laughs> One million? Tens, thousands. Oh, sorry. Ones, tens, hundreds, comma, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands, comma. What was One that? One million. Million, ten million, hundred million, comma, billion, ten billion, hundred billion, comma, trillion, tri ten trillion, hundred trillion. It just keeps going. Remember how we grouped them in threes each time? Okay. Then there is a right of the decimal. And what divides the left side of place value and the right side is a decimal. Okay? Okay, so I'm going to erase that for just a minute. And we're going to kind of go, here's ones, tens, hundreds. And I'm going to put the decimal here. Okay, because I need to write on this side of the board. Okay? So, do you remember, let's just say I had $5.00. Um, and 33 cents. Okay? What would I use here in money to show that? 30? 10. 10 cents, right? Yeah. So 3 10 cents. 3 dimes. Okay? So, the way I want to help you remember is that right after the decimal, because that one is used in dimes, it's actually called one tenth. Okay? ones, tens, hundreds, and then to the right is one-tenth. Got it? Yep. Okay? And then look at this three. Okay? What would you use to show that? Pennies, pennies right? Yeah. How many pennies equal a dollar? A hundred. Guess what this one is? One out of a hundred. Okay? Which is called hundredths. A hundred. You remember this? So everything to the left of the decimal doesn't have THS. It's everything to the right has. Okay? So watch with me. This is ones, tens, hundreds. Okay? But then when we move to the right, we don't go once, tenths, hundredths. We don't have a once. Okay? Because we don't use once here. We use dimes, right? Yeah. So it's tenths. Got it? Okay. Hundredths. Thousandths. Are they not grouped? Ten thousandths. You don't really group them or put commas in these ones. But it still follows the same methods, just adding THSs at the end without the ones. Okay. Tenths, hundredths, thousandths. Millions. Ten thousandths. Oh. Hundred thousand. Thousandths. Millions. Ten millions, hundred millions, billions, ten billions, hundred billions, trillions, and so forth. You understand? Yep. Okay. Now, after we've done that, let me show you something. Let's take this number, 123.45. Now, they ask this question, which digit, which number, is in the hundredths place. Hundredths is five. Five, okay? Good. I didn't say hundreds, or I would have said the one was. I said hundredths, which we know is to the right. So this is ten hundredths. Okay? So five is in the hundredths place. You get it? Mm -hmm. Let's try another number. Six seven point eight nine. Okay? They want to know what is the place value of the eight. Oh, uh, that's ones. No, that's tenths. Very good. Tenths is the answer. Tenths, hundredths. What is the place value of the six? No, that's tens. Too. Ones, tens. Tens. This one's tens with an S. This one. No, this one, 8, is tenths with the X, THS. Got it? Yep. That is lesson 34.